Welcome back to our uh, Epic Mega Grant Development Series for our students. So I'm just going to showcase some of the work that we've been doing. Uh, each individual student has been creating this uh, maze and we found that, uh, well, it's, we found patches of it on uh, uh, YouTube and also we've uh, found a tutorial that in Udemy that we really liked that was uh, excellent. So uh, we've been using that series to kind of learn a lot of what we didn't really know. Um, as you can see, uh, the goal is to get the ball into uh, the hole over here, which you see there's a uh, mesh. And the maze was created using the uh, poly tools that are built in Unreal Engine. So one of the things that we do teach our students is how to use Maya which is kind of complicated, really. And uh, the 3D building tools in, in Unreal Engine are much simpler and are, are, are good enough, probably, for high school students, depending on what their specialty is. If they want to go 3D modeling, they might want to focus more on the art side of things. Uh, what I'm gonna do now is I'm just gonna press Escape, and I'm gonna show you a bit the blueprint that the students uh, developed. There's as you can see this, they created an added materials on it. Uh, and um, here you kind of see, I'll just move around some of the things that they program. So a uh, game that starts uh, whenever it triggers, uh, when they win. So this is kind of the way we've been learning to program. Um, some of our students know how to program, but others don't, and we found that uh, the blueprints in Unreal Engine are just an excellent tool to allow us to, uh, to do some pretty cool things without being experts. Uh, for example, Unreal Engine uses C Sharp, which is kind of hard for uh, high school students. Uh, I know that they do learn it in computer science in the grade 12 classes in, in, our, in our province, but uh, uh, you can't do much uh, that's cool and quick. And so uh, what we like about this is students get a much better sense of, of the game. Let me just move this again. So, uh, so this is the first draft of the game. And you see there are some problems with the ball and the physics, uh, which uh, in the second game I made of design, they learned how to fix those uh, much better. All right, so if you have any questions, please let us know. and. Uh, if you're interested in learning any of these things, uh, don't be shy, contact us. Thank you.